hey girl what's up welcome to a new vlog welcome to a new video my name is Monica. if you are new so today i am just now finishing up my workout um my get down stay down workout that i talk about all the time i'm just now finishing that up today i got a little late start on my workout but technically not so usually when i'm off i try to work out in the mornings but when i'm working i work out in the evening so um today it is now 12 it's now 12:28, and I'm about to make some breakfast and stuff or make something to eat. It's not even breakfast time anymore, but make something to eat um, after I shower. But I wanted to show you guys this product that I just received in the mail. I purchased it with my own money, but I think my code still works. So I'll leave the code on the screen, but it is from um, Timmy Blends. I talk about them a few times here on my channel i've worked with them before but this time i purchased this with my, with my own money but i wanted to show you guys so let me show you so this is the timmy gut love probiotic and prebiotic powder it's a triple berry flavor dietary supplement and it looks like this so i was looking at some ways to you know assist me with like gut health and just basically continue to keep the digestive system going especially with me working out um, because sometimes I feel like I'm, I'm working out at least four to five days a week and I feel like this time around my weight is moving slowly like slowly melting off I don't know if that's about I don't know if it's because I'm older I don't know if it's because <laughs> I don't know but I felt like I just wanted to get a jump start on the gut portion I know that I don't eat the cleanest but I don't eat crazy either so and I don't even eat that many meals a day which probably could be an issue I don't know everybody's body is different so there are so many videos out here on tips and tricks and all that but i'm not trying to do it quickly i am trying to do it for a long term long haul um, i want this to be a continuous journey for me not just lose the weight and then i'm done not working out and not eating correctly anymore this is like going to be a life journey so i went online and i was seeing um you know that this gut love kind of like flushes out kind of like balances everything out and just kind of get rid of any bloating um, is what I'm seeing. So I definitely want to try this out and keep you guys updated on this. So I just got it. So we're going to try it right now and I'm going to mix it in with water. It says you can use it with water or smoothie. Um, mix one scoop with water or smoothie. Consume any time of day, but best recommended just before or with a meal. So I'm going to do it before I eat a meal today and see how this goes. So let's go. All right, so I had to dig in here um, to get a scooper. It looks like it puts like some type of pack in here to keep it fresh. So I'm gonna stick that back down in here, but this is the scooper, a little tiny scooper. So I'm just gonna fill it up, place it in my water. Let's put this back. And I'm gonna add more water, of course, um, to this. We don't wanna waste no product. So this is, this is what it looks like. So this is what it looks like. It looks like the powder doesn't really break up in extra cold water, but. I don't taste anything. I don't know if I have too much water. It doesn't, it doesn't say how much water, it just says one scoop. It tastes like water. There's a little sprinkle of berry. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and drink the rest of this. And then the berry tastes good. It's not like an awful taste, but I'm, I feel like I maybe have too much water. I don't know. Let me know down below if you try this. If you're interested in try it, I'll leave my code on the, on the screen or in the description box below. Let me go ahead and shower and get ready for the day. We have a couple of errands to run, so I'll take you guys along with me for that. And yeah, let's go. All right, y'all. They're working on my side. So they're working on my car. Um, she's getting an oil change and tire rotation. 
So I'm always pumped to maintain my car. Um, you know, all of us, especially women, we tend to drive and keep on driving, but take care of your car and your car will take care of you. But nevertheless, I'm wrapping up here and then I think I need to go to Target because I went to the Target closest to me and they did not have my um, body wash and stuff in stock. So I'm gonna try another Target over here next to or near where I'm getting my oil change at the um, at the dealer. So <clears throat> I will check back in with you guys once I make it to Target. It is now 3.32, so I haven't been here too long. My appointment was at three. Sometimes they be taking longer than an hour, but today they didn't you know, take too long, too much time. So I'm um, super excited about that. So I will check back in with you guys a little bit later. Peace. All right, girls, so we are now done with our oil change and fluids, whatever they do. We are now done with the oil change and all that that they do at the dealer. Um, now I'm heading to a Target because I need to I need to restock up on my uh, body wash and stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Oh, this is the back of here. You ever be like drive? You always drive to a certain place. But then your GPS be taking you different pla different ways. I didn't even know this was a way. Okay, nice, nice. My husband always says you gotta know at least three ways to get to a place, to and from a place, because you just never know when you have to do a detour. Um, and that's so true because I didn't even know that this was all back here. How many of you ever checked this section here? Like the dollar section? This is cute. Like tray. I picked up some items from here the last time. Because they had some cute like home decor pieces. But I thought this was interesting, but I'm not understanding the concept. So it's a vlogging ring light. And this lights up. So what I was saying is, for some reason, Mama, really the lines be on at Target for no reason. And it's not even, you um, Mama? 24 o'clock. It's lining all the way back here. This one is 15. This is cute too. It's a little bit bigger than the clutch I just showed you. And they have this orange. That's really cute. This black one. This black one is cute for like the beach. Look at that. And then glass rose. This smells good. Wood elixir is probably the best smelling one that I'm smelling. I really wanted like a vanilla. I thought they had like a vanilla. Whipped almond could be, could be it. Yes, this smells good. This smells good. Wood almond. You guys, I finally found these. I've been looking at this um, channel, giving like some uh, ideas of food and snacks, like healthy snacks and stuff. And this is the so delicious dairy-free dip coconut milk. It's coconut almond coconut milk bar. So I can't wait to try these as a snack. I'm so hyped about it. They are 5.29 at Target. So we're gonna try those. Um, I think that's all the like, I wanted to try it. You only get um, you only get four bars in here, but I think that's okay because you know, you want to be eating ice cream, you know, 
sandwiches and not ice cream. All right, Target run and done. Um, I'm disappointed they did not have that um, OGX body wash I was telling you guys about. It has coffee and um, coconut in it. I don't know what is going on. Y'all buying it up. Maybe that's what it is. Y'all are buying it up. So they did not have that in stock. So I ended up just getting one of the Method body wash ones. So I guess I gotta wait till they get stuff in stock for next week. Oh, we got warm out here. This one is not a good angle. Okay, it's gonna have to stay like that. So we're gonna do a quick Target haul. So I picked up some grocery items, some chicken tender uh, strips and romaine lettuce. It's not that exciting. Um, some bread. And I told y'all about the ice cream, uh, these ice cream things. I'm actually gonna try one now because we about to head home. We're gonna head home, but I'm about to try one right now. In case I need to just go back and get another one. But I'm, like I said, I am disappointed and not have my stuff in stock. Why would she put this ice cream in the bread bag? Bread, and then I picked up some beauty items because it was spend twenty dollars, spend twenty dollars on your beauty products and get a five dollar gift card. So I got a five dollar gift card, but I told y'all they didn't have my OGX coconut and coffee one, so I picked up the Method Body um, coconut rice milk shea butter body wash i talked about this before this is one of my favorite ones by method body i also picked up some elf concealer could not remember which color i have at home so i picked up two the tan sand and tan neutral of the camel concealer my other one is literally i'm scraping the pan but this concealer is bomb for like it dries very well it gives enough coverage i just really like how this gives a coverage and looks really flawless on the skin and because it's tax-free weekend, as well as, um, I guess that's why they had all this stuff on sale. So these, like, accessories, clothing items, and stuff like that was 30% off. So I picked up this little cute yellow bag. I don't know if you guys can see it. But it has a handle, like a cute little handle. Um, it does have a chain, and that's what the inside looks like. But it's like this cute, like, yellow, I don't know how to describe it, like, um... You know how those puffy jackets in the fall and winter be? That's what this is giving. But the color is really cute and it's silver um, hardware. I love gold, but silver. I don't have a lot of silver things. So I feel like, you know, sometimes you got to have a, a variety in your wardrobe. So this was originally $28 and I got 30% off of that. So those are the items that I got from Target. We are now heading home and see what the rest of the day has in store. So it's 81 degrees out here and people are still school shopping that target will look a mess i think i showed y'all a clip of what it looked like it looks a mess in there so we are now going to go ahead and head home i really want to go back to trader joe's and pick up um this beef barrier that has been talked about with these ramen noodles because i picked up some ramen noodles from target the last time but i'm not sure I'm not sure about that, but let me try this so delicious dairy-free coconut milk bar. Wait, 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 wait. Hmm. Mm. Like I said, I picked these up because for one, they're dairy-free. And it's coconut milk instead of like regular milk. So it shouldn't upset my stomach too much. And they're only 190 calories for one bar. They have enough sugar in it. You definitely taste the coconut. It's like, to it's like coconut uh, chunks on here and almonds. So if you're not a coconut fan, this is not gonna be the one for you because it is definitely coconutty, but it's pretty good. Oh. So I'm gonna enjoy this and get home and then I'll check back in with you guys a little bit later. 
what is up you guys i want to show you guys what i got from the outlet from the beach the outlet that was in um delaware so definitely definitely checked out a lot of marshals and those type of department stores love doing that when we go to other cities and other states so let me just bring this up here and look at the bag they give you a nice paper bag this was a plus for me so i'm gonna start with this bag i put this inside of here so the first thing i'm gonna start with is these shoes these are so cute so they're by the same brand mark fisher i don't know i've been liking mark fisher shoes lately i showed you guys a pair that i have with like rhinestones on them for an event that I've wore in another vlog. So make sure you check that vlog out. But these are so cute. And these were on sale for $26. They were originally 40. So not bad of a price. And they like strap around, super cute. And the color is bright. The only thing I would say is that this part here, I have not worn like a thong heel in so long. So when I tried them on, I was like, ooh, but they're still comfortable because the heel is not high and this little trendy like square toe piece, still cute. Um, I feel like it's a cute shoe. So got these. The next Marshalls bag I'm gonna talk about is more so like skincare and stuff like that. It's a mixture of things, honestly. So I'm gonna start with this. So I saw this new brand I've never seen in any of the Marshalls or TJ Maxx near me, but this is the Clean Logic Bath and Body Exfoliating Stretch Cloth. It says it expands the limit of your clean routine. So the color stood out to me for sure. And I've been looking for a new um, exfoliating cloth. I have a few now, but this one seemed like it was really good. And it specifies that this brand is good for a sensitive skin. So I also picked up the Clean Logic Bath and Body Dual Texture Facial Mitt looks like that pick that up as well it says to catch the best clean sensitive skin can get like I said it has that sensitive skin on here so this really drew me to this so pick that up in green as well as this white or gray color um, and then picked up this one this is a detoxifying exfoliating stretch cloth power up your clean routine with charcoal infused got that for my husband Next in this bag, I picked up this honey pot. I was shocked to see honey pot. I picked up some liners as well, but this is the normal foaming wash um, by honey pot. Picked that up. It was $6.99 for this at Marshall's. Like I said, I picked up some um, panty liners as well. Why not? And the exfoliating cloths were $3.99 and then the mittens were $3.99 as well. Next in the bag, I picked up a stainless steel Apple Watch mesh strap. This is in the color, it looks like it's rose gold. Um, that's what it, I don't know if you guys can see it. But it's like a rose gold mesh type of color. Currently I'm wearing the band that came with it and I just picked up the case for it, but I've been looking for some uh, different bands to put on. I also picked up this shirt. This was really, really cute. I feel like it's a transitional piece. It can go from summer to fall. It's a silk blouse. I know that this is really trendy to wear something like this with some cute heels, some cut up jeans or, you know, loose fitting jeans. I felt like that would be a cute um, date night outfit or night out. Super cute. This shirt is very comfortable. It is by the brand DR2 and it retailed for $19.99 at Marshalls and I got it in a size large. So it fits a little loose, which is what I was going for. And it's short sleeve, very cute print to me. Like I said, transitional from summer to um, fall with the colors. So like, especially like, maybe like the month of September, you can wear that with those heels still and get away with it and not be too cold. The next bag and the last bag for Marshalls is just, I picked up some, you know, when you checking out at Marshalls in the line and they have that section, you just start grabbing stuff. That's what this was. So I picked up a black band for my watch. Picked up a black one. This was $7.99. The mesh one 
was $7.99. So yeah, $7.99 at Marshalls, but picked up a black one that's like a rubber material like the one that it came with. Also saw this at the checkout. This is the Andrea Brushed On Strip Lash Adhesive. I don't have a clear one and I'm running out of my duo, so I just wanna try a new one. But this was uh, $3.99. And as you guys know, I talked about these many a times here on my channel. I love putting these on um, my toes. Um, these are the Dashing Diva Gloss Ultra Shine Gel Palette. And I thought this colorway was just so, it just stood out to me. It was very bright. So I picked up this one and this was $4.99. I love using these um, on my toes. Next up, I went to Kate Spade. They were having a sale, like I think most of the stuff was 70% off. Anywho, I just picked up some little dainty earrings. I love getting like little, I love getting stuff from Kate Spade and the next brand I'm gonna talk about, but these little Spade earrings, I thought were super cute. And then last but not least, I think that's everything. Went to Tory Burch. I was so indecisive in the store. Um, they had some stuff for 40% off, some stuff for 50% off. I believe this one was 50% off. Yeah, this one was 50% off. And I just want to show you guys this particular purse because I don't have a purse like this and I just feel like it's very, very dainty. It's so cute. But here she is. So cute. So cute, let me take the paper off. So cute, I don't have a color like this. It's very sleek. It has a pocket right here. When you open it up, it has this gold. First of all, I'm a sucker for gold. It has a gold um, detailing. It has a pocket in the front. It also has, um, let me take the paper out. So you, well, the paper is holding the chain. It's a chain. Paper is holding the chain, but it has a pocket here. And you can put your cards here. It has a pocket there and then also in here. So I was able to put my phone in here. I could put my little compact uh, hand sanitizer, a lip gloss for my cards, and we're good to go. Like I said, a cute, dainty purse when you're going out for dinner or lunch and you just don't want to have a big bag. It still has that strap so you can cross body it or you can just wear it as a clutch. So of course, I'm going to be wearing it in all types of ways, but this is a really cute, like, they call it like eggnog. They were saying like an eggnog, but it's definitely a little deeper. It's giving yellow, but it's not yellow type of deal, but super cute in a different colorway. So really, really like this a lot. So that is everything I got from the outlets and some department stores while we were out at the beach. So yeah, I'll check back in with you guys a little bit later. So I decided to make some ramen. Um, for today i worked out showered i'm starving but this is a very simple ramen i just put some um seaweed in here a boiled egg green onion hot sauce drizzled it with some sesame seeds and that is that but this is the ramen that i use so let I me show you this up from target and i was like you know what i'm gonna do exactly this and that is what i did so we shall see how this goes hey y'all so it is the next day or so today is thursday and i am on my way to go meet up with one of my really really good girlfriends best friend sister um going to catch up with her um, she is entering into the phase of getting married as well so super excited about that so we're just going to go catch up i didn't get a chance to show y'all this makeup look but it was very simple i was trying to test out that charlotte tilbury foundation again because i tried it out and i was like mm, the girls kind of hyped this one up so i kept trying it i tried it about two or three times and i was like it's still not giving me what it's supposed to give to me so i set it aside didn't wear it for a long time of course the nars uh reflecting foundation has been like the go-to then I went back to try the Charlotte Tilbury today, and it's been a few months now, and I was like, this is why I probably had this sitting aside. I'm gonna keep it real with y'all, especially when it comes to spending your own coin. The Charlotte Tilbury to me on my skin type and tone, I don't know, maybe it's, it's it seems like it's dry, but, well, of course the sun is like gleaming, and that highlighter is popping, that highlighter is Marc Jacobs 
the blush is uh, Juvia's place, but the skin looks, it's skinning. It's doing what it's supposed to do, but I had to like really finesse this to get it to be dewy like I like. Um, even with using my primers that make everything uh, dewy and gloomy. So without the sun, this is what it's giving. My lip combo is my um, Buxom. I'm gonna try to show y'all while I was at the light, but the light has changed. It is 87 degrees out here. Like, come on fall, again, come on fall. Cause this right here, when you getting out the shower and you done got all smelling good and now you step outside for five minutes. It's like, it's time to go back in the house, sis. But I just wanted to check in with you guys on my way to meet up with her. We're gonna have some girl chit chat, catch up, eat. So I'll let you guys know once I get to that restaurant. Um, I've been to this restaurant a few times. It's actually a really good like happy hour spot. Really affordable. And of course they have oysters. If you know, you know. I love seafood, love oysters. So really excited about that. And yeah, I just wanted to check in with you guys. I think the last clip was me showing you guys a haul. I think, I think that was the last clip. Sir. You do not need to go that fast on this road with all these bumps and lumps, but go ahead. Make sure you thumbs up these videos. Make sure your post notification bell is on and you are subscribed, sis. It helps your girl out. It really does help your girl out. It continues to motivate me to keep moving. If you know, you know, Thursdays, I usually do my get down, stay down, fit class. Today, I didn't even work out. Today, I did not even work out. My body is still sore from the previous days of working out this week. I know you're supposed to continue to work out when you're sore, but today I just wasn't feeling it. However, this is my day three of taking that Gut Love by Timmy Blend, so make sure you check it out. Girl, it's so hot that the camera cut off for whatever reason, because it was overheating, but um, I don't even remember what I was saying. Oh, the Gut Love stuff from Timmy Blends. Make sure you try that, because day three, I'm gonna keep y'all posted on it. I'm gonna give it two weeks and then I'll give my final like thoughts on it. But I'll do a check in after this week. Today's only Thursday, as I mentioned. But I don't want my phone to overheat again because it is sitting on the dashboard. So what I'm gonna do is holler at y'all when I get to this uh, restaurant. Y'all, I made it. But let me tell you, people be parking so crazy. It takes up multiple spaces, and I'm just trying to figure out your car is not that big. You don't need to park that flat. Like, you don't need to park like that. Nobody parks like that. This is like older lady. You try to be respectful to the older people, but they're the ones that be messing up. Jesus. Anyway, I made it down here. And I want to show you guys where we are, um, where we're going to be eating. But I'm going to stop at Marshall's because, like I said, Marshall's is right here. So let me show y'all. you guys so i am now back home and i'm gonna wrap up the video here um had a great time catching up with my girl so um i did show you guys the food that we ordered and yeah i didn't pick up the camera because we were having conversation you know what i'm saying but nevertheless i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog make sure you give this video a thumbs up hit that subscribe button and until next time love peace and beauty i'll see you guys in my next video 
Bye.